What is going on guys, it's Jake and today in this video I'm going to be talking about the storyline for the infection map on Exo Zombies. It's just going to be covering uh, how the main characters got there from what we see from the, anima or, uh, the cinematic trailer and uh, what are we doing here? What, are we, what is Burger Town's purpose and uh, why are we in this location? It will be covered in today's video. If you guys are interested in the ending easter egg for the map infection, what happened is explained in this video on screen if you want to know what was the purpose of the easter egg. If you guys could hit the like button, that'd be greatly appreciated, and if you guys want to subscribe for more ExoZombies content, I, I suggest you do, you'll, you'll, you won't regret it. So basically, how did the original characters, oh, there's my phone, how did the original characters get to this map? Well, we see in the cinematic trailer that Atlas actually comes down, they're wearing their, uh, their suits so they won't be infected, um, they pick them up from, with a warbird, and then they put them on these kind of uh, trucks, or these big huge semi-trucks, and they ship them off over to this next town next to Atlas facility, uh, the nearest city or whatever. Uh, where Burger Town is found as well. And being overrun by zombies, the original characters of the main crew are the only ones left to survive in this kind of sewer and then above this kind of like Atlas uh, facility power station as well as Burger Town. We also know for a fact that the warbird that is coming to save the survivors isn't actually Atlas. It's um, people that are against Atlas that we are going to be calling rebels in this point of time, but we might figure out who they are in the later map packs. So the Burger Town's purpose is to cover up and hide the rebels' plan to take out Atlas with a rocket. We don't know exactly where the rocket goes, but we can only assume that it's going to be explained in the next map. The so-called rebels were taken over by the outbreak and killed, and that's why the main character's purpose is to help them out where they left off, get parts around the map, and set off the rocket, activate Bubby. Bubby has nothing to do with the, uh, the uh, main storyline, but uh, it's a pretty cool thing that they added where he comes alive and helps you kill zombies. During the outbreak, Atlas set up their kind of uh, buildings all around the uh, area of the, uh, the huge Atlas facility. That's why we see a power station that was uh, used by Atlas in uh, the back of the main spawn. We know that the warbird that comes and saves the survivors isn't Atlas because of a quote we hear from the character that I'm playing as right now. So in conclusion, these main characters in Exo Zombies were to fulfill the rest of the purpose of the rebels to send off the rockets disguised in the Burger Town. We didn't. The reason why it was in Burger Town is to disguise it because Atlas is watching from satellites, and they would get suspicious suspicious of activities on the ground. So they built their uh, secret uh, rocket inside the Burger Town logo or the Burger Town statue to hide from the Atlas satellites that they're watching from. Later maps will reveal, possibly will reveal what, where that rocket is headed and what the effects were. There's just a short little storyline explanation. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you guys slap a like on the video and subscribe for more ExoZombies content or 2015 Treyarch Zombies content. I'll talk to you guys next time. Goodbye.